Hi, Diva Lovers, and welcome back to the Queen of the Craft Room. In today's video, I'll be making a Dollar Tree wall scunt. Here is our supply. You're going to need some mosh pot if you're going to recreate this project. You're going to need some glitter. I pick up these from the Dollar Tree. I pick up this glass from the Dollar Tree. Um, this mirror looking like thing. I'm doing a set, I'm not gonna show you both of them, but it's the same. We're gonna do some gemstone I'm using gold. So what we're going to do, we are going to I'm going to move the back in because I'm going to put the gems on it. So I'm going to remove everything. gonna put it back up so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna bling out the frame so I'm starting with the inner circle going right around And all of my item is from the Dollar Tree except the, the glitter, except the glitter and the mud pot. But everything else from the Dollar Tree. I wanted to paint it silver, but you know, I have enough silver already. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do gold, gold wall scunt. And now I finished doing the inner circle. I'm coming on top. So I'm going right around with the gems.
and we're gonna fold this up I wish Dollar Tree would come with some more gems especially the silver ones I love the silver gems And I want to take this time out to thank all my subscribers. All my old subscribers, thank you very much for your love for my last video. And for my new subscribers, thank you for subscribing. And welcome to the Queen of the Craft Room family. And don't forget to subscribe. Turn your notification bell on so each time I upload, you'll be the first to know. So guys, huh? I want to come, I want to do this full time. This is something that I love to do. I love it, I love it, I love it. So I'm going to need you guys to subscribe. Oh, come on. What's the problem? You know, I can't do this, do this without you guys. So what I'm asking, I'm trying to reach a thousand subscribers. I know you guys can do it. I don't know why you, you guys won't stick. Do I have to get some glue? Over here, won't stick for whatever reason. Alrighty. So I need a little glue on these. I don't know why it won't stick. That's why that's all it's white. Let's hope it dry clear.
I'm going to put some Mod Podge on it anyway. So that they stay, but I don't know why. It's giving me a problem already. Now, as you can see, this is time consuming. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna finish it off camera. You know, I love to watch me a little movie while I do this. Here's some of the time. So you have an idea what I'm doing, okay? So I'm going to finish around here and now I'll come back and move on, okay? Alrighty, so this is what we look like. I'm going to put some Mod Podge in it. So they are... Um, They don't keep moving. And put this aside to dry. And then we're going to move on. The Mod Podge keep the, keep the stone them down. And I guess give it a little glass because it says it's a, it's a glass Mod Podge. Right, so for the inside piece of the mirror, I'm going to cut out I'm going to cut out a piece of this cardboard gold piece of paper for the inside I'm gonna trace it out can I find a tracer can I find a tracer oh my god it's a 
show you guys when I put down anything I can't find it. If my grandchildren them was here, I would blame them all the time. Believe you me. So this is the centerpiece. Should I cut it in or out? I'm going to put this in the center of the frame. Alrighty, so it's gonna look like this. And it's too big. And I should have cut it from the inside. And I'm gonna get some glue. Okay, that side not working. So we're gonna use this side.
and guys if you're liking this video so far please give me a thumbs up So we're gonna let these dry and come back and move on. Alrighty, so this is all mud podge up. Done. We're gonna set it aside to dry and we're gonna start and now our cup or wine glass, I should say. Now, I was looking for, I was looking for my, I was looking for my cutter because I wanted to cut the glass off from here, but I believe I'm going to keep it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some stones on the bottom of the wine glass. I'm going to put some stone on the wine glass and we're going to go right around what it and we're going to pull it out as well I wanted more of these wine glass but to save my soul I couldn't find any more I found two at one store and each and each Dollar Tree I went to I couldn't find anymore. And I mean I went a long a long way for this one. And I just can't find any more. I don't remember seeing it online either. I have to check again. I mean, I wasn't really looking for it online. But I didn't even stumble on it online. And they go in the party section. Where they keep all their um utensils. I I didn't see it. I truly didn't see it. So it's going to look like this. So I'm going to bling out everything from top to bottom.
And we're going to mud fudge this as well. And let it dry. Okay. So here we go. So I'm gonna finish here. I'm gonna mud pot it, mud posh when I finish, let it dry, and then come back and move on. Alright. So this is what we look like. And we said we was going with the, with the, I found this in my stash. This little baby candle. I never can see it. Candle. Candle stand. So what I'm going to do. I'm gonna put some bling bling on it. So I'm gonna go right around. And guys, I have a bonus for you. I didn't get to do it in my last video. I want to thank you guys again for all your love for my last video and the one before. And for my new subscribers, if you haven't seen that video, go ahead and check it out. I said I was going to spray it, go, but since the gemstone is on this one as well, I'm going to just put some more gemstones on it so it looks like a uniform. I believe I got this from the trip store too, where I bought. There was some that I bought there. Um, and they were like crowns. Say, so, oh, I'm always picking up stuff like these because I never know when I seriously gonna use them. And I like it.
Okay. So that's it. Oh, you scared me a while ago. So it's going to look like this. Isn't this cute? All right, so I'm going to put it on display. And let you see it. All righty, so here is the finished look. Okay, so don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Okay, leave me a comment down the bottom and tell me if you like this wall scunt. Okay. Until I see you in my next video. Love you guys. Walk good.